Good morning, sir. <laughs> I tell you, yesterday I sat here till six o'clock in the evening, and it was just hit after hit oh, after really? hit after hit. Wow, what was happening? Ah, oh, uh, they were just buttes. You were just oh, on yeah. a roll. Absolute corkers at the top, top draw, one after the other, after the other. So is this your way of trying to say I won't be here next week? You can play the following inserts. <laughs> 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 no, no, no. I want to be here for them. Trust so me. So which right. shining light did you pick for this morning? I, I want to start with something more, let's say, educational, <laughs> and more of a warning. Okay, because. There's a lot of phishing scams going on around with the banks and a lot of people giving out their bank details to mm. a bunch of scam artists. And we, we get them, we look at them and we go, well, these people must be stupid, you mm-hmm. know, to give out this stuff. But these guys are good, I must admit. That Absa one going around is extremely good. Well, you don't realize anything until, firstly, you know the banks will not communicate with you via email yeah. to mm. change those details. Mm. But secondly... If you just look at it on face value, it's a very good ripoff of the Absa site. It's only when you click on it and it goes to uh, something .co.ce. Yeah, and it's not the absa.co.za. No, then you know, but uh, my uh, Gmail dot something. A lot dot, of people never look at that. Yeah, exactly. So it's quite easy to get scammed. Now, now there's this lady called Nadia. She's very worried about her mom because she's a mom. Willy nilly will give out information on the phone. Okay. People will ask her for anything and she won't ask questions. Doesn't suspect any wrongdoing mm. with anybody. Mm. She'll give it out. Mm. But there is one piece of information, and this was my challenge. She said her mom would never, ever give out. So Nadia, what is the one piece of information that your mom will never, ever give out? You'll never get her bank details out of her. She's, she's very serious about keeping that safe. That's one thing you won't get. Never you will get her bank details, ever. Okay, let's see about that. Hello? Hello, Ria. It's uh, Jan Fria from SARS. Yes? I wonder if you can help me here. But we've just had a system crash on our side. Yes. So I just needed to verify and re-input certain information. Yes. In order to process your tax rebate. Oh, I I don't pay tax anyway. My husband is the only one that pay tax. You done as as the wife? No, I don't work. I'm a housewife. I yeah. don't work. Uh, you still his wife? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, well, well, that's why it's come up here. And uh, after many attempts to get hold of Donny, we haven't been able to today. Yeah, he's uh, at council. He's apparently he's the only one there. And he's uh, got a uh, hectic week this week. You know, he's the only guy to work. The other two guys, one is six and one is on sta- uh, on leave. So what we needed to do, uh, we've got a rebate that we needed to pay him from the receipt of revenue. But they did pay us already, so how much money they still owe us? Well, actually what happened was, is that the amount that they paid you was, in fact, a little bit short. Oh, oh yeah. Shit. I remember because well, they paid 4,000 something odd rand in his bank account. There's still another 2,100 that we owe you. Is it? Our system wasn't uh, apparently 2010 compliant. Oh, I see. Yeah, so as soon as it changed it over to 2010, um, okay. the, all the computers just had a bit of a freaker. But what, what I can do, because I need to make this payment today, because yes. today is the official cutoff date. Oh, so, my goodness gracious me. Mm, what I can authorize is to put it in your account, because it's basically use it or lose it today. Yeah, but it's no problem if I can put it in your account, if you can just... Uh, can you find me back within five minutes? Because well, I just need to go and get my account number. It's in the safe. Oh. So I'll, I'll hold on, yeah, because... Will you hold on? Okay, yeah. thanks very yeah. much. Okay. Because I don't want sure. you phoning anybody else. Wow. Yes, yes. yes. Not, yeah. exactly. <laughs> I cannot believe she's going to give it to you. I can't believe it. Uh, let me... See. Firstly, which bank is it? Standard Bank. Yes, okay, so it's O2. Yes. Yes, I'm finished. <laughs> okay, and then uh, which branch would it be? We normally go to the new one. In okay. You be- sure? I just want to ask you a question. Don't be. Saying, this is not a scam, eh? Oh. Oh no. After no, she's no, no. given. No, no. Of course, where you get the people, and then you get all the stuff, and you give them the information. Then by the time you get to the bank, all your money is out of the mm. bank. Mm. Let me just put yeah. you over to my uh, advisor quickly. Hi, Mrs. Costa. Do you know who you spoke to? Uh, I okay, does Wackett Simpson sound familiar? Oh, <laughs> nee oh, nee oh, nee no. oh, 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 o
Oh, no, Wacky. <laughs> Mrs. Costa. Yes? <laughs> Let me tell you, Mrs. Costa, there's a lesson to be learned here, all right? I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Not I'm going to kill you. That's just cookies. I'm going to kill you. That's not the lesson. No. Not a joke, Clayton. Look, you know what I said to Nadia? I don't think they will ever, ever catch me on the radio and stress my cookies. You do. <laughs> yeah. You see, it's that easy. Nadia. Nadia. No. There's a lesson for you. Yes. For everybody. Never, ever, ever divulge ever. any of that information. Don't get the year off to a bad start. Because if you're unlucky, it'll be a scamster. And if you're even more unlucky, it'll be Darren. Yeah. Oh, and by uh, the way, sorry, Mrs. Costa. Um, don't check your bank account till Monday, okay? Yes. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>